What's up guys? Today we're back with another video. This project is optional, so you can watch the previous video to understand this science concept. We'll be making the target stand. The materials we need for this are some wood stand bases, some wood stand crosses, some paper targets, and some V-foams. So let's get started with the project. You're gonna to have to place your two wood stands like this. So first, take your wood stand crosses, and you also have to stick the V-foam on them, align it with the two edges, and you have to stick the V-foam on them so that the stability of the structure is more. So you will have to. All right. The next step after putting all of your all of your foams are that you have to just put it in like this and balance it with both ends. You have to place the V foam downwards. So the V foam should be facing down because then the stability of the structure will give in. There you go. You see how it's just standing and it's not tilting over to one side? This is the stability of the structure. Do that for all of the three ends, each one facing down. All right, so there you go. Now, take one of your targets out, your paper targets, and place it right here in the middle. I, uh, you can choose whatever color combination you want, but I'd prefer yellow in the middle, red around the sides, and blue on the corners. So let's just put all of them in. Let's just hang all of them up like this. All right, so it's ready. Hooray. All right. Now we're gonna make a cannon. For this, the materials you'll require is a paper tube, some tape, some black sticky foam, some brackets, and some, and some clipboard rings, as well as a balloon. For, the, for cutting the tape, you'll need scissors. All right, so take the balloon and just cut it. As you can see here, I've already cut a balloon. All right, so take one of the Take one of the paper tubes and stretch the balloon. And wrap it around the paper tube. Stretch it a lot. I've already done one for the blue one. And now we're gonna make it tight with the tape. Let's go ahead and do this next step. Next, take your brackets out. Every one of the brackets. Let's just stick it on like this. Let's do this for all of the brackets. All right, so now what you'll do is you'll, and we're gonna just put it on top of the paper tube, just like this. Now, peel the black sticky tape from the other side, just like this, and then stick the bracket into the hole of the clipboard ring. 
just like this. So it sticks now. All right. Now let's do the other two sides. Okay. All right. So let's just peel all three of them. And let's stick them. Just concentrating to peel this off. This is how the cannon works. Whoa! I got blue and red, okay? Well, let's see what else I get. I hope I get the yellow one, really. All right, let's try this again. Did I get the yellow one? Oh yeah, I got one of each color. All right, well, that was the experiment. Hope you liked it. And once again, this was optional, but if you really wanted to do this, then I think it was a really cool experiment. So try it out and let me know in the comment section below, did you get the yellow one? You can try to make your fun air cannons and play with whatever game you want. Peace out, folks. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.